In this session, we are going to discuss about different approaches of probability. Mainly, there are three different approaches in probability. They are classical or mathematical approach, frequency approach, and axiomatic approach. First is classical or mathematical approach. For a random experiment, if there are n exhaustive, mutually exclusive and equally likely outcomes or cases and m of them are favorable for happening of an event capital A, then probability of happening of an event A can be defined as m by n that is probability of a is equal to number of probability of A is defined as number of favorable events divided by total number of events. In on simples, it is P of A is equal to M by N, where M is the number of favorable events and N is the total number of events or total number of cases. For example, consider a class containing two girls and four boys. Now what is the probability of selecting a girl from the class? In this case, sample space S is equal to, since there are two girls and four boys, we can write the sample space S as G1, G2, B1, B2, B3, B4. Here, G1 and G2 represent two girls, B1, B2, B3 and B4 represents four boys of the class. Now here we are interested in the event of selecting a girl. So we can define A as an event of selecting a girl. Therefore, here the number of favorable cases for happening or selecting a girl, M is equal to, out of the six students in the class, only two are girls. So the number of cases which are favorable for selecting a girl is two. M is equal to two. And the total number of events or the total number of students or the total number of elements in the sample space S is 6. Therefore, in this case, probability of A, that is probability of selecting a girl is equal to 2 by 6 or 1 by 3. So, first of all, we have to define the sample space S. Yes. In this case, S yes includes 2 girls and two girls and four boys. A is defined as the event of selecting a girl. Now we have to find the values of M and N to define the probability where M is the number of cases which are favorable for getting a girl which is two. 
n is the total number of events that means total number of elements in the sample space s which is 6 therefore p of a is m by n which is 2 by 6 equal to 1 by 3 this is called this method of uh, finding the probability is called classical or mathematical approach